Hello, and welcome to a special Celebrations-themed episode of Poke Openings. Uh, as you can see in front of us, we've got quite a few Celebrations products today. Um, and this isn't all, but I'm not going to show you what's in part two until part two is out, in which case you'll, you might be able to see it from the thumbnail, I don't know. But anyway, today, uh, Tim is joining me, Hello. Uh, as he's done in the last few episodes, and we're going to kind of just you know, go through and stuff. Now, Tim's opened quite a few Celebrations packs already. I have. Uh, I've I've not opened any yet. So I've kind of been saving. We were planning on doing a few at the start of the month and a few at the end due to delays and stuff. We're just doing one big three-part video. So stick around for that. Not going to spoil what part two and three are, so stick around for those. Uh, anyway, in front of us, we have um, seven tins collectively. And two pin, no, sorry, one pin box, one one of the other, like, promo boxes. So these four are mine, these three are Tim's, and those two boxes are mine. Uh, so we're going to kind of take turns and open things. So I'm not going to keep rambling. I'm going to move Tim's stuff to the side. Actually, I'm going to put those in the back as well, so BRB. Right, okay, I'm back. So we've got four tins. Um... Three of these I pre-ordered when I found in the wild. So, uh, actually, tell you what, we'll just do them in order. We'll take a look at them as I'm opening them. Um, so I'm very excited for this. Mm. Tim has pulled some pretty cool stuff so far. Yeah, there's a couple of things that I'm hoping to pull today. I won't, uh, I won't tell you what they are, but um, I've seen a few things that I'm like, oh, I didn't pull that in my... Uh, in my current openings, so if we can get some of those today, I'll be a very happy boy. Yes, and uh, we'll discuss celebrations. So what I'm going to do, we're going to quickly open these tins, and then put them into two piles, which is celebrations and non-celebrations, because all of these things also come with non-celebrations. So that's the front cover of the Johto tin. Very cute, very nice. That coin is fucking huge! That is... Oh! Oh! <laughs> I didn't... Yeah, until I picked that up, I was like, hey, is it? Wow! Okay, so that's the 25th anniversary cut. That's beautiful. Very nice. Oh, and the fact I got four of these is great. So, uh, we got an art card. I'm glad to see as well we have full border art cards. Because yes. I think, was it the Shining Fates one? Had yeah, like, like the border. And it was yeah, like, and it, it was like the cover of... It together and it makes like one big picture. So strange. Uh, oh, there we are. We've got some like, if you want to uh, pause there... Shows you how to set it up and... Ah! So it's like a two-layered things. Tells you about the Pokemon there. I'm not going to read it out, but if you want to pause and read it. And of course, the main reason everyone buys these uh, is for two packs of Celebrations and one pack of Darkness Ablaze. Right, I'm going to go put these uh, in two separate piles, as I've mentioned there. And close up the tin, I'll grab the other one. Alright, second uh, in line is the Sinnoh tin. So, uh, unfortunately, because I kind of pre-ordered these blind, as it were, I just put in a pre-order for three tins, uh, and I bought one in the wild as well, I didn't really get a chance to choose them or whatever. Tim, luckily, was actually able to choose which tin he wanted, which is why his is more sequential um but this is gen 4 piplup turtwig and chimchar very cute and appropriate because next month the remakes are coming out yeah uh so yet again we got that lovely lovely coin very nice oh and this this one so my other one had a bit of a sprue left over from the pre uh, like presses but this doesn't so this is a nicer coin already psa 10 coin yeah sending these off a of psa 10 grading boys uh, so that's the thing again. Obviously, you're not going to be able to put it next to the Johto one, but you know, technically, I can. Uh, Piplup doesn't look like he's having a good time. He doesn't. He's him. he's been pushed down or something. Um, I'm guessing darkness ablaze. Looks like it. Yeah, boy. Well, that means more chances to pull that Charizard, which I've already <laughs> pulled again. <laughs> which I've already pulled. So, if I, man, if I get two, I will be very happy. Tell you what, I'm not even going to jump cut. I'm just going to. Put these there for now. Uh, so we'll get on to Univa, uh, Gen 5. So this is a tin I'm very happy I got. Oh, I am. Because um, Gen 5 is definitely one of my favourite generations of games. Um, and also I love Oshawott. He's probably one of my favourite starters. Um, his whole line is amazing. 
So there's the embossed one. I do love that they're raised and everything. Very nice. These these tins are lovely on their own. Oh wow, there's a coin. This is going to get old very fast, but there we go. Hey, even smoother. This is... Oh man, we've got at least two PSA 9 coins there. Uh, so we've got we've got Gen 5 there. Very nice. I'm calling Vivid Voltage for your pack in this one. I don't think you're going to get that. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Oh no, it is. Take it back. Oh man, they, they, they want to get rid of Darkness of Blaze, it seems, don't they? Uh, right, and then there is the last one, which is Sword and Shield Gen 8. I am right yeah. saying Gen 8. I think cool. between us, we've got everything except for 6 and 7. Ah, there we are. Yeah, now I'd have liked 6 because I really like the starters from XY. Um. To be fair, I do. I think I like the starters from every gen. Yeah, like, none of them are duds, really. Yeah, I mean, there's one or two like of the Pokemon I'm not crazy about, but you know, it's Ooh, as a whole. Oh wow, hey, that's what. What's the bottom like? Ah, a bit of sprue. Too much sprue there. That's the art card. That's uh, that's very cute as well. There we go. Put that there. What's it going to be? What's the other pack going to be? Can you I guess? Like wow! Yeah, wow! Four. Hell. All right. Okay. I'm going to tidy everything up briefly, and then we'll get on to opening the darkness blaze, and then on celebration. So BRBA after this jump. All right. We are back. So we got four darkness blaze packs. Pretty happy with that, to be honest. Uh, I like darkness blaze. I mean. I don't know how many cards from the set I have now. Probably a lot. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I, for most sets, especially Sword and Shield onwards, I'm pretty certain I've got something like 50 to 60% of all the sets. So, you know, uh, we're going to go through these pretty quickly because we've all seen the cards from there before. Yeah. We've got a Steel. Um, oh, pull, wow. Right off the bat. A Monkey Pearl, an Ice Cream. Hey, Clang, that's cool. Oh, and Clink, that was, that was a cool uh, little thing. Got Ducklet. Hey, Mareep, that, that made up for it. Paras. Uh, Gothita, very nice. Ooh, Reverse is Corvus, uh, Corvus and Corvus Knight. Ooh, hey. yo, let's start. Hound Doom Feet, definitely don't have that card I either. I don't think I've seen that, bloody yeah. hell. Darkness of Blaze, and I'm still seeing things that I haven't seen before. That's a really nice card. Yeah, really digging that, actually. That's quite it's quite an unusual pause for Home Doom. Yeah, um, dynamic. I, I like it. Yeah, so right. Cool. Let's go on, get on to the next one. Wow, what a, what a start. So as I mentioned, we'll get more into discussion celebrations as we open it, but there's a lot to be hyped for. Mm. Um, right, let's put that to the side. Two, three, four. Four. I hope that's four. Fire energy. No, nope. the exact opposite. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. We got uh, Leon's cape. Nice. Ooh, okay. And a uh, powerful energy. Very nice. And a powerful sun Pokemon. Torchic. I'm sure that's a reprint from Ruby and Sapphire. It uh, looks like it could be. Uh... Uh, I got Aaron or Aaron. I don't know how you really pronounce it. Rookie D to go with that Covenant. We've got Wishy Washy. Oh my god! Okay, got the whole monkey line. Okay, nice. Uh, oh, very, very, very pensive Dartrix yeah. there. And okay, we've got a Hydreigon. Uh, no, it's not a hollow. That, that's strange. A Hydreigon that's not a hollow. That's not something I'd have thought I'd seen before, but whatever. Um, hang on. Hey, I'm back. Sorry, I. Um, I like to put the code cards underneath me, but um, they both fell on the floor, so we've we found a uh, solution now, because we're going to get a lot of code cards in this video. Uh, I think it's safe to say so. And they keep swapping, whether it's like facing the end or facing the cards, so yeah. you can't kind of remember which, which packs you've got to do what with. It is strange. Right, we've got Grass, we've got, okay, by Bravo, it's been a while since I've seen that. Uh, another a different goth eater. Are there, oh wait, no, sorry, it's a goth tell. That's why. I was gonna say it's like, are, are, are there two in the things? Oh, we got Pokemon breeders, no, breeders nurturing. Very nice. We got that Feebas. Mm -hmm. We've got Purloin. Hey, Hippopotas. No monkey so far. No, no, no. Cute centret. 
We've got a long, nice long, ooh, ooh, that's cool, turbo patch oh, reverse. Nice Always nice to have trainer reverse it. Ooh, hey. oh, and it's a hollow Galissapod. Okay. Nice. Hey, out of, God, out of three packs, I got a hollow and a V uh, and a regular red. That's... Yeah, not doing bad so far. Now, is this... Well, this is the chart. This is the sign. Obviously. This is what it's going to be. I'm wondering, so Tim mentioned his tins are wrapped differently. Yeah, they are. No. Very interesting. Does this mean he's got a different print set? Because, like, it might be his either earlier or later than mine. Mm. Uh, I which... wonder if mine will be not darkness of blaze. Or yeah, like Vivid Voltage, and that would be cool. Um, but. Let's start anyway. So we've got a steel energy. I'm going to do them like this now so I know where I'm at. Hey, Genotic. Yes, Mr. Burns. Uh, Earthering. The uh, Rose Tower. Very nice. Hey, Sinisty. Carabla I've seen that Carablast so too nice. much. Uh, Meltan. We've got a Marini. Pearl. Oh no, I thought that was reverse. This is the reverse. Lunatone to go with that Sol Rock earlier. <gasps> No, the okay. Regular Astaroth. Well, I mean, hey, to be fair, I got a V that I don't have. Yeah. Um, you I'm know. Not so putting those to the side there, right? Good stuff. <laughs> now celebration. So we've got eight packs. Yeah. Now for those out of the loop somehow that are watching this, um, just to point out, these are four additional cards um, instead of the eleven. Because it's a very limited set, I've watched him open a few, and I think there's 25 in the 25, because 25th anniversary. Yeah. Which took me so long to realise, like, why is it such a small set? Are you going to do um, one to the front? Because the classic card, like the reprints, <sighs> yes. can be in the third slot. So, so, the other thing for those uninitiated, Celebrations has a chance of having a classic collection card, which is a reprint of a card from a previous set. This goes, uh, there is a code card in the back, isn't there? There is a code card, but they're all going to look the same because cool. uh, you're guaranteed like four um, models at least. So there's a chance in the third slot of this pack you'll have a classic collection, which is a reprint, which is anything from like an EX card, which is pretty cool, all the way to Charizard. <laughs> so, I mean, that's the one everyone's after, but, you know, I'm not I'm not holding out any hope. Let's change the angle a little bit there. There we go, right. Okay, so everything's hollow, you're guaranteed. I'm going to do one raw, and we'll see. The thing is, with putting one to the front, it is uh, you do have a chance of getting, like, a full art and stuff. Yeah, there are some really good cards in the, in the fourth slot from yeah. Celebration. So. so you'd have to, like, s switch them, and it's very awkward. So We'll just continue. So we've got Xerneas. Very nice. Ooh, Xerneas and Evil Tal. Perfect. Back to back. Obviously, Hollow again. Ooh! Yo! That's beautiful! <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> Fun fact, right, this has got like a weird glittery effect. Mm. So I have this card in both languages because <laughs> I have this in English, but also at a Comic Con, which I went to with you, I bought a pack which I thought was the newest set in Japan that hadn't come out to you. I think it was, I think it's Breakpoint or something like that. Yeah. Um, but as it turns out, it was actually base set X and Y, and of the one pack, because uh, in Japanese cards, you're not even guaranteed a rare. No. But I pulled, in the one pack I bought, a Zunia CX. That's, that's a nice, oh. I didn't even know that was in the set, I haven't seen that before. That's, that's a really nice one. So I'm loving the, like, glittery affair, that's, that's cool. Uh, um, wow, well, so there we are. Your first pack. Yeah, so this is part of the classic collection. You can tell it's classic uh, to differentiate from the original as well, because it's got Pikachu there. But it does have the same set number and everything on the Yes. Um, it's really nice. Hang on, let's see. There we go, as Tim mentioned there. It does look like it's a card just from the set. But there's a bit of a texture mm. as well to this, which is nice. Right, and our last one is Mew, uh, part of the regular Celebrations set, but never a bad thing. That was a I was a strong pack to start with. For sure, for sure. Um, so we haven't. I mean, it it would be boring to look up the statistical breakdown, but as Tim was opening, it seems to be one either a one in three or one in two packs. You tend to get the classic 
Yeah, you, uh, yeah, and I think there's, there must be a different rarities to the actual ones you pull as well. Probably. Some of them seem to crop up more than others. Yeah, um, there was a set. I can't remember which set it was, but one. Oh, wait, no, no, Darkness of Blaze, sorry, is like the Charizard, despite the fact it's a regular GX, mm, yeah, 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 VMAX. Yeah. Anyway, right, let's get into the second pack. We've got DJ Lugia in the house. Xerneas again. What's it gonna be? Okay, it's part of the regular one, but it is a Kyogre, which I do not have. So I'm hoping by the end, I'm saying hoping, I know by the end, I'll have all of them. All the regular. Oh, yeah, all the regular. Yo, let's go. Okay, so Surfing Pikachu, uh, Tim's pulled two of, I think. Yeah. Um, and I was like, right, if I don't pull him, I'm gonna have to trade Tim for it. But, ah, oh, <laughs> that's beautiful. I'm so happy. So that's one of the lost um, cards in the regular set. So this is part of celebrations. I mean, you've got... It, well, you've got a chance of pulling it in the last slot of the pack, which is pretty nice. So that is one tin's worth of celebrations down. Uh, and after this, obviously, I'll switch over to Tim. He'll do his tins, and then we got those boxes to get through as well. These are going to be long parts, just to say, get get ready for it. Which is why it's a three-part thing, because otherwise it's going to be like two and a half hours or something. Wow, Zunius, every pack so far. <laughs> Lots of Zunius. Uh, fair enough, though, I suppose. And Evil Tower. This is exactly like the first part. Yeah, it's like, wait it's like... a second. A okay, it's a Zekrom. Uh, happy to get that. Hoping to get Reshiram so I can complete that one. Is Mewtwo in this as part of the... Uh, I don't think he's part of the regular set. Ooh. Hey! Ah, yeah. oh, so this, uh, for those not in the know, I suppose, is a reprint of the base set Pikachu, but in full art form. Um, and this is original base set Pikachu because they did change the cheeks to red later on because mm -hmm. um, they realised there's a bit of a coloration error and people were wondering where his red cheeks were. So this is true to form early, early Pikachu. He do be chubby. Yeah, that's, uh, that is, I, I, I do, I do miss chubby Pikachu. I mean, they technically brought him back. Chubbier than ever. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, in fact, they made original Pikachu look like, uh, Look like a lodge, you know. Uh, right, okay, so these packs are slightly awkward to open because there's so mm. little of them inside, there's no weight to hold it. So you've got Dialga uh, and Lugia, so I'd like to pull a Palkia as well. I've got, is, there's a Hobo? Yeah, there? yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. Oh, Zunius, fantasy <laughs> Every pack so far. Jeez. Hey, and we got flying Pikachu. There we go. So this is the other Pikachu thing. Um, so I've intentionally, apart from the cards Tim has pulled, um, I've intentionally not seen anything. I've not watched any videos, despite the fact YouTube has suggested like dozens of them to me. The only ones I know, there's obviously the Charizard reprint. Uh, there's a few Tim has pulled. There's the Here Comes Team Rocket from yes. the Team Rocket set. Uh, I'd, I'd really like to pull that. Uh, and I know I did see from a thumbnail there is the reprint of Blastoise from base set as well, I want to say. Yes. Um, so, I mean, I'd be over the moon if I pulled Blastoise. I mean, if I pulled Charizard, they'll be cool, because obviously it's Charizard. Mm -hmm. But, like, Blastoise is the one I'd really like. Yeah. Uh, anyway, so we begin this pack with Cosmog. So this one has a bit of a story, doesn't it? So yes. Lily grows up through the cards. So keep an eye out for that. we got Cosmog. Oh, Zunius. <laughs> every pack. Every single pack. Evil Tal. There you go. Long okay. Fair enough. Will the last one be a cool full art one? Uh, no, but... Ah, there we are. So Sol Galio. So another part oh, of the... Sorry. Yeah, Lily thing. Very nice. So we've got two out of four of the Lily cards. Another... You know, thing I'd really like to complete all of. I love story cards. Yeah, uh, really. Was it, it was it the plasma thing that I think had Charmander? I know there's a really nice um, Tepig one, isn't there? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. So. Oh yeah. No, I think Charmander was shining. Um, shining, not shining fates, but like the other shining set. Um, from a while ago, I think there was a Charmander one as well, of a family growing up. So we've got Evil Tower, we're going to do these pretty quick now. 
We got Cosmog again. Got yes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Uh, so we got two packs to go. It's going to appear in every one. Ooh, Zaki and V. Let's go. So this is three of the full full art I'm aware of in this. Oh, actually, no, no, I am aware there's a V Max as well. I shan't spoil it for the viewers, but there is a V Max I'd quite like. Um, yeah, right. Okay, two more to go. Uh, hopefully, you guys are enjoying. Uh, and also, let me know below if you've pulled anything. Have you pulled the Charizard? I mean, uh, if you do, that's like ultimate bragging rights for quite a while. So, uh, there we are. So, I want to pull Cosmium. Cosmium? I'm sure you will. I'll yeah. Them. We got Lugia again. Ooh, no. Okay, Groudon. Very cool. I like that pause. Hey, there we go. That's the V Max I was on about. Look at him. He's huge. He's bigger those, than the plane. Those balloons. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, and there's that plane there. Those balloons. I'm sorry, Pikachu, but I don't know what you're making like hold you up. It's, it's not those. <laughs> oh, man. That's... I love that card. It's so good. Ah, oh, it's so happy. I, I may not have pulled many classic collections so far, mm. but. You've got plenty more to go for. Yeah, and like. I feel like I've basically ticked off every Celebrations I wouldn't mind the Zaman's Enter V, I mm. suppose, because I'm assuming Zaman's Enter V is obviously part of this as well. It'd be strangely biased to just have Zaki in. Right, we got that Groudon. Oh, and Kyogre. There we go. There we go. Is, this a, is this a sign? Hang on. Oh, yes! Let's go! Look at that so, cute little Bit of a baby. texture as well with this one. Oh. Um, so this card I have in Japanese, actually. Uh, it's very nostalgic for me because uh, back in the day, well, on the Japanese card, uh, Cleffa is called P. P.I. <laughs> uh, and it's very cute. Oh, I'm so happy I had this. This was another one I was quite jealous of. Ah, cool. And I know Tim's opened loads of these, but uh, Professor's Research, I love the dynamic like arm really thing. Cool. It's, uh, it looks like he's written it, you know. Right, I'm going to go tidy up my ones then, uh, and then we'll slide over to see what's in Tim's tins. So, BRB. Hello, we are back. And by we, I mean me. Um, I have one less tin than Rid, because I ordered them online. Uh, my main goal was to get Gen 2, because Gen 2 is my favourite. Um, but they had everything when I managed to order, so I just went 1, 2, 3, because those are the best ones. So we got the Kanto guys, the Jolto guys, and the Hoenn guys. Uh, I'm just going to go in gen order. So yeah, as Rid mentioned, mine are wrapped differently. Yeah. His had the cellophane around the whole thing, mine's just got this little binder on the front. So I'm very curious to see Yeah, I, I if that means there's different like different general packs in here maybe, but uh... The only other thing I can think of is where you ordered it. Maybe They've resealed it! Maybe they opened them from the cling film and then put this around, but it doesn't make sense. Like, I don't think they They've do. weighed them! Yeah. We've got, uh, oh look, a nice coin. Wow, oh, fancy truly that. new and shocking. We've got the uh, the Canto lads, the classic ones, and they've put a little Pikachu tail hiding in the oh. bush. Very cute. Nice. Right, moment of truth. Let's Ooh, see what... Oh yeah, uh, when you get the same packs. So, nice. two celebrations. Oh, yeah, a Darkness of Blaze! All right, Fancy then. that. What a well, surprise. That's three more chances to get a Charizard. That is true, that is true. Let's see um, what's in the Johto pack. It's uh, a bit nostalgic for this one. Also, fun fact I do have another of these Johto tins. Um, as Because I pre ordered blindly, as it were, I saw a shop selling two of the tins. Which means I've got one sealed. I, I'm not going to open it because there's not much point, really. No, yeah. Uh, so it's nice to have one sealed as well. You can look back at it in the future and be like, yeah. there you go. And retire. Uh, oh, look, a darkness of blaze. Wow. Can't see that. Oh, truly, shocking. truly shocking. And let's see what's in the Hoenn pack. Let's see. My money's on. Base set. Uh, yeah, yeah. There's, oh. Cool. <laughs> oh, can you imagine the money they would make? Oh, if grief. they were just like, right, well, like one in 200 tins has a base set pack. <laughs> oh. There they are. Mudkip, very cute. They're all very cute. They're having a, a whale of a time. Nice. 
And we have two celebrations and, and a darkness wow. of points. Oof. What are the chances? Right, okay. Let's uh, crack into these darkness of blazes. Um, oh, I got three of the arts, none of them are the Charizards. Uh. So, um, guaranteed no Charizards, and every single one is going to be um, monkey pulls. Let's see. Let's see now. Let's see what we got. It's, uh, I think, you know, if, if you get a V out of this, I think you've done well. Yeah, fire energy. Okay. We have fire energy, we have the trio, we have Ariados. We have an old PC, Meltan, I've seen these cards so much. Fire <laughs> Blast, Sinistee, Toxol, uh, Bunnelby, uh, Reverse Trapinch, okay. and a regular ass Golurk. Wow. Thank you, Darkness of Blaze. Okay. The card game really likes Golurk and Golurk, don't they? They do show up in a strangely high amount of sets. I wonder if, I guess if they're one of the only psychic Lines that only has one evolution. Yeah. Because like Goth Eater's three, Ambra's three, Solosis is three, the ghosts are mostly three, so yeah. I just like to throw them in. I, I, don't, I, I quite like Golu and Golu, yeah. so I'm not angry. We have, starting off with a Psychic Energy, we've got a Yellhorn, Relicanth, Solok, Aeron, Starly, Purloin, Marini, Meltdown, we've got a reverse Gothita and oh, a hollow pin curtain. Oh, okay, I'm pretty sure I have three of those now, so uh, that is fantastic. Oh, it's an interesting choice to make with pin curtain and hollow. Yeah, yeah, I have nothing against him, but um, yeah. it's not exactly a uh, he's a cute sea co cucumber, but like that's it. Yeah, yeah, I... what else have you got going for you? There we are. Okay, last darkness of blaze. We have a fighting energy, nice. a bird keeper, the Denny, Dartrix, Nugget, Larvitar, Galarian Dalaraka, a Carablast, Ducklet, a Reverse Fletchinda, and. Ooh, 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 ooh Rhyperia V! Hey! hey another um, Darkness of Blaze that I have not seen yeah, before. Yeah, no, that doesn't look familiar. That's. Hey, that's uh, oh, hey, I'm, I'm happy now. That's fine. Wow. That's fine for Darkness of Blaze. Well well done. You've uh, you've done me good there. Yeah. So the same as you. Um, one one, one hollow, hollow, one V, and yeah. Yeah, wow, that's. Uh, Fair play. I'm yeah. not complaining about that. These have turned out well. I guess I'll open these uh, celebrations as well, I guess. So we've got six of these to crack into. Nice. Let's see what they provide. By the third video, we're just going to be like, first two, I don't care. We've seen too many of these. I wonder how many Xerneas I'll pull. Yeah. Right. Uh... We have a Zekrom. Nice. A Cosmark. A Xerneas! Wow! Oh God, what are the chances? Enough. And a Lunala. Wow. Hey. Um, okay, nothing new in that first pack. That's no. fine, that's fine. It's building up. Actually, it's... you know, I don't think I pulled a Lunala, so I think that's the first one on the video. There you go, that's something, so... that's something. It's got, um, it's carrying on the Lily story. She's yeah. looking very, uh, very heroic there in the background. Strangely, Cosmium is like one of the only ones we haven't seen. That, Reshiram and Ho-Oh, yeah. I think. Yeah, which I've pulled loads of those when I opened the other one, so I don't know why they're not showing their faces today, but mm. whatever. Starting the next one with a Lugia. Nice. We've got a Palkia. We've got a, ooh! Ooh. Team Magma's Groudon! Yo! Hey, hey. Let's go! Oh, it's one of those really cool ones where it's like dual type. I I oh. freaking love that when it's like both. Oh, yes. Yes, right dark and then. fighting. That, yes, I don't have one. I'm very happy with that. Thank you, yeah. Celebrations. I think that's probably from that's the great. Ruby and Sapphire Team Agma Team Aqua set or something. Probably. Was... That sounds about right. Yeah. Focus on the date. 2004. Yeah, wow. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. that's uh, e-reader series essentially. And we have Sol Galio. Again, yeah, with are. Lily looking very uh, very Lily in the background. Yeah, I think that's full power Lily. There we go, yeah. Full power Lily. She's had a mega revolution. Yeah, exactly. Let's see what's in the next pack. 
Okay. Yeah. We have Weshy Wham. Yeah, there we are. Ho ho! Ah, there we go. <laughs> You've probably seen all of the like common ones yeah. from uh, from the regular set now. Then we've got Lugia and oh. Flying Pikachu V. Nice. <laughs> there we go. He's a big. He's a big boy. That's fine. I'm guessing Zakian and Zaman Zenta are only in V then, and they're not. I don't think there is a V Max for them. No. Yeah, well, uh, that was in like, but we don't get a rare of them either, it seems. No, 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 no. So no. it's only in. Which is a bit of bias, I think, but also, I suppose, because it's. Yeah. Sword and Shield era, they've kind of got to. But, Makes sense, you know. really. We've got a Xunius. Wow! Fancy that. We've also got a Nivelto. Oh, 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 uh, right, cool. Uh, oh, oh, oh my wow. good grief. Oh my god. Ah, oh, I'm shaking a little bit. Oh my god. I was, I literally was pulling that away. I was like, oh, that's another ho or something. <gasps> that's a fucking chance. Oh, man. This early into the video, <laughs> this is... Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Look at him. Oh, shit. Oh, oh man. Oh, I was not expecting that. Holy shit. Oh, that. Right. Uh, I'll grab you a sleeve. <laughs> <Like, laughs> Holy shit. Wow. That's beautiful. And what's the other items behind it? Um, oh, full up Pikachu. Oh, cool. uh, God, that's nice. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, well, wow. I'm going home now. Thanks thanks for having me, Red. I'll, uh, I'll wow. see you next time. <laughs> yeah, because that, that took me a sort Because I was like, is that Nine Tails? And then it's like, wait, no, it's not. No, that's not. <laughs> it's <laughs> the boy. <laughs> Yeah, man. I've literally gone a bit, a little bit shaky. Fuck. Oh man. Well, I don't think we're gonna top that today. Yeah, but oh my uh, god, that is two more packs to go. But it's two my more packs to goodness, go. Oh. that is. <laughs> oh man. That. Well, there we go. <laughs> there we go. Everything Absolutely. else now is just out of curiosity. I think. Yeah. Just like, oh, what else could they give us? <laughs> oh you know. man. I cannot believe that. That. Whew. Right, we well. got a, uh, a Palkia, I guess. Uh, we got Ho -Oh. We have Lugia. Cool. And we have Professor's Research. Yay. There you go, add that to the pile. There we go. And last one from the mini tins. Come on, my pulls have been so bad yeah. so far. Do give me something, give me something, man. Decent. <laughs> you know, just <laughs> like a level oh, oh, oh. You know, oh, Azunius, the whole Azunius. Yeah, come on, come on, give me Azunius. I deserve it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, we have Ho -Ho. We have Cosmog. We have Iveltal. Uh, and we have Lunala. There okay. we go, ending on uh, Nice. Park. Well, uh, <laughs> all right then. I <laughs> Wow, I have no words. I... Um, that yeah, thank you um, to whoever's looking out for me up above. Thank you, Arceus. <laughs> thank you, Arceus. I'll be uh, sure to do my prayers tonight. And yeah, um, join right. us for part. No, there's no, still more. Yeah, got boxes the, to open. We got two more boxes, so give us a minute to clear up, and we'll be back for the last part of part one. All right, we are back for the third part of the first part. We got these two boxes in front of us, um, but. I'm going to take a quick look and instead of making you sit through the unboxing process, I'm just going to jump cut to when they're open. So the first one we have is the Celebrations Deluxe Pin Collection. So uh, we'll take a look exactly what's in there in a second, but I'll give you guys a look at the box. It's got Zakian, it's got a card, uh, it's got a pin, it's got some packs. Let's look at the back. So it's got a Pikachu's Tails motif kind of thing there. It's very, very shiny. Uh, yeah, and it's very nice. So, I am going to go and open this. So, BRB. Hey, there we go. Right. So, uh, a quick look at what's in the box. We have this fold-out pamphlet about how Level X's work, I suppose. Or Thank you. The history of Level X's. There's nothing on the back, but cool, I suppose. A little bit of a um, paper. <laughs> yeah, not going to lie. It wasn't something I was looking forward to, but wherever. Uh, we do have the uh, Zakian Level X itself which is very nice. Very nice uh, for those of you unaware Level X or something during the Diamond and Pearl era it was kind of a predecessor to EX's I suppose which obviously was a predecessor to GX which 
led to these. Uh, and this is the coolest thing. So, uh, in the shops, I, I'd read that it was a pin featuring surfing Pikachu and flying Pikachu. And I thought, ah, oh, that's cool, but I may have to buy two of these boxes because I've got surfing Pikachu. I'd love flying mm. Pikachu. However, there's a bit of a mechanism here where this little part here, it changes so he's flying. He's both flying and surfing. But if you're bored of that, Chuck him back on his surfboard. It is the coolest yeah. thing they've ever done, hands down. This is, um, yeah, well, it was strange work. Because I was looking in the shop, because I did manage to see two of these in the wild. And I was like, they're both surfing, though. Is there, like, a rare version of flying? But no, this is, it's so cool. Like, hands down, the coolest pin they've ever made. Um, all, honestly, almost worth the box itself. Uh, and of course it comes with two booster packs as you can see there is a vivid voltage and a chilling rain and four celebrations so I'm going to stack those there and then move those to the background there uh, we'll begin with vivid I think and then chilling rain yeah uh, we'll go chronological order again we're not going to focus very long on these because seen a lot of these as well yeah seen so many cars and you know it's it's not why I <laughs> It's not why I bought any of the celebration and stuff. No. Uh, you know, I, I'm certainly not against opening more Pokemon cards. And, you know, I've already pulled a V, so that's cool. But let's begin straight away. Swoobat. Very nice. Loadroot. Uh, oh, okay. It's been a while since I've seen Zeb Striker, actually. Uh, we've got uh, Meowth Galarian Foam. We've got Chimeco. Ch Chimeco. Chimeco. Oh, Blittle for the Zeb Striker. Slugma. Nice. A um a, a Beldum, very nice. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, let's go boys! Hey. Amazing rare right? I fucking love oh. amazing rares, bring them back! Okay, cool. Well, this box is almost <laughs> That's fantastic! That is mental. I don't think I have this either. This is um I think you pulled it in one of the previous videos and I was like, God yeah. damn because I pulled two of the um the other one, I can't remember what the other card was that was amazing in this set, but... Uh, is it, is it oh, Kyogre. Kyogre. There's and, Reshiram as well. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, I pulled Reshiram. Oh, I've got all three now, I think. Solid. Unless... Anyway, what's the last one going to be? Uh, Electric. <laughs> wow. Downer ending, but... <sighs> oh, card. let's go! Holy crap! I, I, so nice. I forgot about Amazings, so I, I wasn't... Yeah, I wasn't expecting anything. All right, chilling rain. Um, There's some good things you can get from chilling rain. Yeah. Oh, I'd love me a Galarian Moltres. There you go. Uh, no, sorry, a Zapdos. Um, yeah. Oh well, yeah. Any of the. I don't think I have any of the Galarian birds, so that would be cool. Um, but you know, but that's not really the star of the show. So I can I can live without pulling anything crazy, but. Let's begin with fire energy to heat us up in the cold, obviously. We've got a uh, Crabominable. Uh, oh, that's cool. Spirit energy. I don't think I've seen that one before. Or maybe I have. I don't know. Yay, we've got. Uh, yeah. What the fuck is honey? Uh, is oh, oh, um, she's in the dojo. She's the one you give points to. Oh, I'm pretty. Yeah, I, God, that took me an age. I was like. Do I know her? Anyway, Diglett being cute, School Bunny being cute, Shepard being, being cute. cute. He, yeah, yeah, I, I'd say. Angry cute, yeah. Yeah. yeah give it a Blitzel. Another Blitzel. Yeah. Two for two on Blitzel. Oh, there we are. We yeah. have Peonia. Very nice. Damn, I don't think I've ever pulled a regular Peonia, so that's there cool. You go. And we've got a Galate. Oh, uh, okay. Non hollow, but I don't think I have that Galate. There you go. I will. Oh, my card's sideways. Right. I was going to open both boxes and maybe do like eight packs, but I thought we'd, we'd split it up a little bit to yeah. make it a bit more hype. So we're going to jump into these celebrations. Um, don't forget, as I mentioned, this is just part one. We've got some cool stuff for part two and some very cool stuff for part three as well. I think... So many celebrations. Oh, yeah. I, so I've worked out. I think I'm opening like 34 packs overall or something of celebrations. I... I'm going to pull something nice, hopefully. Yeah. So we got Dialga. Uh, oh, hey, hey Cosmium! Hey, there we are. That's the only one I'm... Oh, wait, no, I don't think I have Lunala, I think. 
our next one is Palkia. Who don't think I have Palkia? <laughs> Yay! There he is. So we are going to see a lot of these as well, I think. Um, as I was discussing with Tim off camera, they kind of take the place of hollows in this set. You're yeah. not going to get them every pack, but you'll get them regular enough that, you know, I, realistically, if you open 10 packs, you're probably going to get most of the full arts, I think. You know, probably, yeah. It's, yeah. it's easily one in two or one in three packs. So, uh, you know, the V Maxes are a bit more rare, it does seem, but. Yeah, cord card to the side. Begin with Groudon. Liu Gear. Okay. Reshiram. I don't have that Reshiram, so let's go. go. Hey, uh, Pikachu again. <laughs> Very Shanty nice. And, you know, honestly, I'm going to have so many that sort of I'll happily give one of these to a friend or whatever. Mm. Or, yeah, yeah, I'm sure there'll be plenty of doubles. You know, it's. Uh, it's going to be bizarrely one of those common full arts, I suppose, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, for sure. Uh, right. Ugh, third one. Oh, these are opening quite nice, actually. The other ones were, like, all a bit strange. But these I can just tear open nice. So, got that going on. What do we got? Reshiram. Um, Groudon. Nice. Cosmog. Oh, Mew. Oh, wait, no, yeah, I did pull a Mew. I think you did, yeah. Oh yeah, sorry, so to continue our conversation, I Mewtwo isn't in here then, it seems. I don't think he's in the regular. Side. Ah, right, okay. It, yeah, it makes That's, sense. Yeah. It's, uh, my prediction for Mewtwo in the classic is either base set or that very famous EX Mewtwo that everyone played. Oh, I've seen it, but yeah. I will not say. Cool. Well, hey, we may pull it. We may. Last yeah. pack for this box, but we... Oh, it's Actually, Zernius. do you know, it's the first Zernius hey. of this box. Never mind. Yo, let's go, ho -ho. Hey. Cool. That's where I wanted. We've got Zekrom, so oh. not the best luck for Classic in this one. Oh, yeah, literally hey, zero, zero Classic. What the fuck, Zachary in box? But, you know, we still got lo we still got lots to go to, don't worry. Yeah. Right, I'm going to clear this up and we'll get on to the Dark Sylveon box. BRB. All right, we are back. So, uh, yet again, I'm just going to show you briefly the box and then we'll, like, actually break into what is in there. But this is Dark Sylveon V, so we'll take a look at the promo in a second. So the side, this is the uh, Pikachu tail motif again, and uh, I've got to say, it's one of the most jarring boxes, because we got a cute, uh, a cute, happy little Pokemon there. She is not cute or happy there. Somebody so. has wronged her. <laughs> Someone's done something and no one's sure what. But anyway, I'm going to crack into this box now, so I'll BRB. Yeah, there we go. That was a smooth transition. I hope I put my hand in the right place. Right. <laughs> So we've got another one of these like weird things that explains dark Pokemon this time. I don't even know if you can see this well enough on camera. You can probably look up the scan somewhere. It's pretty self-explanatory, dark Pokemon. Yeah, I, I don't think, I think it does affect technically. You've got to like evolve it from something, but actually she's a basic, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. Um, so this is the big, the jumbo card to have a look at. Uh, I really like this art. This is beautiful. Oh yeah. Um, so unfortunately, I couldn't get my hands on the Charizard box, uh, the Lance's Charizard, but you know, maybe in the future. That's the regular card. And this time we are graced by Battle Styles and um, Darkness of Blaze. Last time was Vivid and... Chilling Rain. <coughs> so between the two oh. boxes, you've got like one of each, basically. Yeah. I'm going to do Battle Styles first, yeah. I think, because this could have something interesting. Uh, let me change the camera angle there. I may have to face more up in a second, because I think we may get some shadows on the cards, but we'll use this Battle Styles pack as a test. Uh, oh, okay, well, if if you want to claim that code, Ooh. go ahead. Uh, you're, you're welcome to it. Consider it a gift. Right, grass. We Hang on, I'm going to change the viewfinder angle. There we go. Right, okay, we've, wow, Gold Bat, it's been a while since I saw that one. Uh, we've got Mustard, one of his styles. Oops. We have Spoopa, we have Cheruby, no, uh, yeah, Cheruby. I always get them mixed up. Uh, we have Horsey, very nice. Murkrow, mm -hmm. Bronzo, hey, Bellsprout. 
reverse uh, Galarian Mr. Nightmare. Um, oh. <laughs> oh! All right then. Battle styles, come on. <laughs> Ooh, I'm changing the angle of the camera a little bit there. Uh, just to hide my tears. Wow, that's objectively, I think, one of the worst packs. Literally. Uh, Nightmare fuel. Yeah, and twice. But there we go. This this will make up for it, I'm sure. Yeah. You know, it. We've already pulled one Charizard in this in yeah. this video. Let's have a second. That would be nice. Right, we're gonna go through this quick again, as with the other one. We got powerful energy. Soul Rock. Scene, uh Electric. We've got a Fletchling. There it fucking is again. Third oh, one oh, in two oh, packs, oh. boys. We've got that Torchic. That Aeron. That Scene again. Mm. Woo! Let's Ready. go, Salamance go. V. That's a nice one. Not bad. Not bad. All right then. There you go. Thank you, well, you know, so far, <clears throat> we've had pretty decent things in that. One of the packs have been meh. Yeah. But the other's always given us a V, or amazing. Balance. In, uh, yeah. So we got four. I didn't get any classic collections last time. Which means all of these will oh, be. Oh man, that's the fucking dream. So, I'm going to start going through these a bit quicker as well. Part two, I imagine, will go quite quick, because... Yeah, uh, the bloody Xerneas, here's the bloody... Yeah, Zekrom, Zekrom and uh, Reshiram and stuff, yeah. So... Ooh, this is a very tight pack. It just yeah. does not want it. Jesus Christ. Okay. Cool. Thank you for allowing me to... Uh... Right. Okay. So we've got Cosmium again. Uh, we've got Grodon. We've got uh, Kyogre. Hey! we got Yay. Surfing Pikachu V. Right. Three packs left of this first part. Um, Oh yeah. <clears throat> I don't know the statistics, but this is like a third of the celebrations I'll be opening, so... Mm. We're gonna get something, I reckon. Uh, hey, that opened a little bit better. Right then! We begin with Lugia. Cosmium again. Is, is this gonna be the uh, the reoccurring one, I wonder? Palkia? And Pikachu! One. Hey, there we go. You know, I think I may give one of these to our other friend Tom. There uh, you, go. you know, just as a, uh, a gesture of goodwill, you know, and a little present from. We won't tell him how common these Pikachu <laughs> are. Hope he doesn't boss He'll be like, dude, are you sure? And it's like, well, I, you know, I, I, I could have kept it for my collection, but I thought, no, man. You deserve it. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, you know, it, it is a very nice card. I um, I feel like I saw it a while ago, like a, a month or two before Celebrations came out, mm. and I thought it was one of those custom cards people make. <laughs> so, uh, wow, what a surprise. Oh, no Cosmium yet. Okay, Got a ho oh, a Cosmium. Cosmium, there we go. Uh, and the Solgalia, which I don't think I have, so... There you go, you, you should have the uh, full Lily yeah. storyline. Do I have a Lunala? Have I pulled one? Uh, you will have by the end of the day, I'm at yes. 99.9% sure. That's what we want, so... Let's see what this will be. Uh, ooh. It would be nice, just to finish this video off with a nice... With a bang! Yeah. There's the Cosmo. Cos <laughs> so it has appeared in every pack, I think. Yep, I think it has. Reshiram. No, oh, Grodon. And Mew. All right, well, that wraps up part one. But stay tuned, because part two will be going up a day after this one, hopefully. Uh, we've got quite a few more things. I'm not going to spoil it, but we have... What shall uh, we be opening? A lot of packs to open. So stick around for that, and we'll see you guys in the next video.